piezoelectric accelerometers, applications, calibration, and some specifications. First, some applications from the Kistler website. What are accelerometers used for? Engine research and development, diesel engine vibration is a big concern, vehicle dynamics and durability, cutting force, monitoring of joining and assembly processes, weighing trucks automatically, monitoring of injection molding processes, monitoring of forming processes, joining systems, product testing, vehicle safety, biomechanics, Piezoelectronic sensors are explained at the PCB Piezotronics Incorporated website. Squeeze a quartz crystal and a surface voltage results. Quartz crystals can be compressed or flexed or sheared. Various sensors can be constructed, force sensors, pressure sensors, and accelerometers. PCB Incorporated uses their ICP process to measure sensor voltage. There's the quartz crystal. ICP sensor is a miniature integrated circuit within the sensor housing. An external power supply provides 2 milliamps at 18 to 30 volts DC to the micro circuit amplifier. A voltmeter or oscilloscope can read the changing voltage originating from the piezoelectric crystal. This circuit block diagram demonstrates the ICP process. PCB Incorporated provides a calibration kit. That's the signal conditioner and the shaker, 1000 radians per second, voltmeter to measure the RMS voltage, sensors, accelerometers and a force sensor, connection cables, sensor mounting studs, accelerometers and a force sensor. That's a quartz shear accelerometer another quartz shear accelerometer, a ceramic shear accelerometer, and a ceramic shear accelerometer, and a three-axis ceramic shear accelerometer, and a 10-pound force sensor. Next is a calibration of that accelerometer. Sensors mounted on top of the 1G 1000 radian per second shaker connected to the signal conditioner and then the voltmeter is expected to read 0.1 volts RMS.
Replace the voltmeter with an oscilloscope. Note the frequency of a thousand radians per second, or 159.2 hertz.